Mark Pope uh, is is now your new head coach your Kentucky yeah, Wildcats. What do you now. what do you think of that change going from John Calipari to Mark Pope? What should Kentucky fans think of that? Because right now they want to attack me because I think it's a step down. You? Well, I was astonished to hear of a uh, Mormon Pope. <laughs> I thought that was strictly Catholicism at work there. I, it to- totally caught me off guard, that, Dave. That's pretty good. So uh, you, you, you pray to your wife, I guess, in that situation. I don't know who you're supposed to pray to. So, but John, here's why I wanted to get one, to one of your wives, one of your wives. I've gone through Pope's background and already think it's a bad hire. And now I was convinced because th- he did this when he was introduced. Let me just show you what he's holding up real quick when he gets off the bus at Rupp Arena because, okay. you know, they decide to do this. I want to play this. I want to play this. But I remind you that John's time is brought to you by our good friends at Newbrook Collision Center. Now in its 45th year, the second and third generations continue Joe Newbert's commitment. His vision of what this business needed to be we still try to live up to that. Joe Newbert Collision Center. Okay, so run this out there. There we go. All right. Mark Pope yeah, yeah, getting yeah. off for those that are on our audio platform. They appear to be in Rupp. They drove a bus into Rupp Arena. They drive a bus in there like it's a some sort of monster bus rally. And Mark Pope gets off of the bus. John, I want to make sure you can see it. Do you have visual confirmation? John, John, you see it? Yes. Uh-huh. Okay. okay. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and play it. All right. Here's what. It's- but anyway, I'll turn it all down. Wait. You see what he's holding? You see what he's holding? Oh look. Oh, look at that, John. What's he holding? John, let's get some play by play. Coming in from the bus. Headed to he is the holding. court. John, what's he holding? Can you tell? He is holding the 1996 National Championship trophy for the team that he played on, as if that is somehow a qualification for him to get the head coaching job at Kentucky. Yeah. <laughs> John, I'm going to do I'm going to do the research really quick. The <laughs> prospects that he will be going after, some of their parents will have been born when Kentucky won that 96 national championship. So I understand the recruiting implications can be monstrous for the Big Blue Nation. Well, what impressed me about that video, I thought it was a contest. Is all these various people got off the bus. I think they wanted the fans to identify which one is, is Mark Pope. I couldn't tell. I, I thought, is that, is it that guy? Uh, no, it's that one. Oh no. I think it's more, looks more like that one looks more like Mark Pope. It, it was uh, really bizarre. I thought. Yes. And he came off last, which he may end up being among uh, teams in, in the sec Um, there's all kinds of rumors coming out of Kentucky about why perhaps um, you had John Calipari make that sudden move. What was your read on the move? What will he do at Arkansas? Um, Because, man, he he pulled a kiffin on the cats. He left them timing-wise in a bad, bad position. Yeah, I I have one more thing to say on uh, on Mark Pope. Can I still do that? Yes, yeah, well, yes. Mark Pope, I, stick with the Mark Pope. I, That's good. Yeah. yeah, I mean, we could go on after that, but yeah, can you can you get ready to cringe, Dave? That's can you prepare hot. yourself to cringe? I'm ready to cringe. I, I think it was an attempt by Kentucky because when, when Calipari there, there was a lack of unity among the fan base. And, and okay. some people – was still back i think kentucky what it's trying to do is unify here so it's trying to bring together the mormons and the catholics by hiring a mormon pope 
That's I'm hot. not letting go of that, Dave. No, I can tell you're not. Well, I mean, I think we'll be having this conversation in five years from now, like Constantine Ritzman. That's hot. To be fair, um, I think uh, Kentucky uh, had. I think it got nixed down. They've been tra- they they can't get rid of the child bride laws that still exist in Kentucky. So uh, Mormon, you know, might. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> Um, I'm sorry. Bad joke. Bad joke. Uh, what, you? what the hell just happened, Caleb? Caleb there, there been, a a there child been, spousal explain, joke. Caleb, explain, yes, and, Caleb. Explain. I know at least until 2018. I don't know if it's changed, but at least until 2018 in Kentucky, you could marry off your daughter before she turned before she was even a teenager without well, her consent. To today's tough question: Would you marry off your daughter for a five star yeah. prospect? In Kentucky, you could. Anywhere yeah. in Kentucky? The, there were no laws against marrying off your daughter. You, you couldn't marry your daughter, but you could marry her off. Like, you could arrange a marriage with her and somebody else. Until 2018, I believe, is when it was. Um, now, even well, though... I think, um, are, we, are we at the, all sure about the this? State, the state has evolved since then. That's six years ago. Since 20... <laughs> And guys, I, there's a lot of states that are like that, so I'm not going to try to take a shot at just Kentucky because there are some. We Is Tennessee realize. like that? Can you do that in Tennessee, Caleb? Let's look it up. Tennessee child bride law. No, we're not going to do that. No, we're not going to do that. The Mark Pope hire. How can that possibly be good? And and listen, Tennessee fans and every SEC school, they've been down this path before, where you get jilted by your coach. And you're going to say the next coach is great. But I can't find anybody in my phone, my Rolodex, that knows basketball that tells me this is a great hire, John. No. uh, I just wonder um, if Kentucky even considered bringing back Rick Pitino. Thank you. It's exactly what I said. I would have made the phone call. I would have been done with it. I would have gotten four or five good years out of Patino, who I think will be 71. Uh, that's ex- It would have been done. I would have had the call made before Arkansas could hold their stupid press conference in which John Calipari <laughs> looks like introducted for the 1996 Chicago Bulls. <laughs> yeah, um... It's funny. So, John, the funny thing about that is many Kentucky fans, their selling point on Mark Pope is that Rick Pitino says he's going to be a great coach. Because what do you expect Rick Pitino to say about one of his former players? Like, oh, I don't think he's going to get the job done. <laughs> Rick, <laughs> Caleb, Caleb, Rick Pitino said Wade Houston was going to be a great coach. Yes. <laughs> and, 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 John, what's the likelihood that this happened? That a Pitino call was made and he said, Sounds good. Work that out. Ten million a year, and they said, "Whoa, we thought we might get you on the cheap." You know, you're trying to rebuild your career, and he says, "No, I don't. I don't think so." And then they went yeah. to Pope. Does anybody want to bet that that's what happened? Because I'll lay that bet down. Brought to you by Bet US. I don't think that's what happened, Dave. I don't think they <laughs> they call Rick Patino. If they did. I think it would be a done deal and he'd be the coach at Kentucky and fans would all be excited. Instead they got, and when he, Hey, and when people got off the bus, the fans would have known, Oh yeah, that's Rick Pitino. They wouldn't have had to guess, well, which one is Mark Pope? (laughs) (laughs) He's he's put on some weight since he played here and lost some hair. Yeah. He's so big. (laughs) So, so John, um, I wanted to just know your quick thoughts on it because we made fun of it last week and Arkansas fans are now mad at us because I thought that press conference they held for Calipari was the goofiest thing I ever saw. And they had all these former players at Kentucky that they touted who said they committed to play for Calipari. And in my mind, I'm like, these are all the players that like they're famous now for underachieving at Kentucky because they didn't have Anthony Davis, the one guy that won him a national title. They were naming John Wall and people like that. And I'm like, this doesn't really help your case for Calipari, does it? (laughs) It's almost as though you're trying to to sell Arkansas fans on what Kentucky fans had to believe in. Yes. We're going to have the number one class in the country. If that's the number one you're going for, 
yeah, that might be a good move. Hey, we got the number one recruiting class. Game over. Yeah, that is exactly what they were going for. Yeah. John you're going to get these great players. You won't win a, you won't win that much, but you'll get the great players, but you won't you won't hang any more banners. Seems like the worst time to see Calipari walk through the door now that NIL is completely legitimate. Seems like that's like oh bleep. You know, he had the guy and maybe if they'd have hired him 5 years or 10 years later there wouldn't be the hurt feelings now because he hasn't won at a high enough level. Just seems like you're getting rid of the used car sales when right when the used car sales are about to go through the roof. Yeah, I mean Kentucky now is you can give a player a racehorse. It, it, it's legal. That's right. He, not he even Godfather. Be, not even he, Godfather style. No, he can be a you know you can be a basketball player slash jockey. Is John Calipari the Coach most likely to leave a horse head in a op opposing athletic director's bed. Uh, that's a pretty good call, Dave. I'm trying to think of somebody else. I'm on moments. John, get out I of here. I don't buddy. know if I'd I don't know if I'd cross uh slick Rick though. It could be some bad things happen too. Well, an <laughs> urban Meyer had a certain guy he could call while he was at Florida. Thanks. No, he just did it himself. <laughs> He's a Russian hit man. <laughs>